it seems all to you have a reputation of being very nice. Uh, online, there's a uh, Mark. You must know MarkRuffalo.net. I heard about it. Oh, you go there every day. <laughs> <laughs> Only when I'm feeling bad. <laughs> Do you really go there to cheer yourself up? Every day. Okay. <laughs> I've never been, honestly. Oh well, everyone on there just keeps going. He's so nice. I met him. He's so nice. I met him. He's so nice. I met him. He's so nice. But we did discover one disgruntled fan. Okay. Now don't worry. You did nothing to him. Uh, what happened was, his name is Jared, and his sister called him from an airport <laughs> and uh, said, uh, Mark Ruffalo's on the phone. Uh, would you, you know, talk to Mark Ruffalo? Uh, <laughs> That's he, it. And he, right. felt, yeah, he felt like he blew it. What does he say? Um, I'm sure I came off as some regular old gushing fan, vomiting flattery all over him. So if I could have scripted our conversation... It wasn't like that, I remember. Do you really remember? I completely remember. No, do you really His remember? His sister Jody handed me the phone... That when is I was the Jody's the sister! This, this is the guy. <laughs> Jared. Yes! Yes! I did that cut. I have eight fans, so it's... <laughs> 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 yeah. I have eight, Jody. so I don't have to remember them all. <laughs> Well, poor Jared, poor Jared was so upset about this phone call, which was so nice of you to do. So he's, he has scripted how he, the phone call should have gone. So yeah. if, you, if you could mind playing Mark Ruffalo, I've printed out... This is, this is, this is the phone call. That, so Jody has handed the phone to Mark Ruffalo. Jared is somewhere. I'm Jared. Hey, Jared. <gasps> hey, man, I really enjoy your work. <laughs> Thanks. Seriously, ever since I saw you in You Can Count On Me, I thought to myself, this is a guy who can do basically anything. Jared, that's the nicest thing that anyone's ever said to me. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're a phenomenal actor. I mean, 13 going on 30, collateral. I mean, despite the, the relative smallness of those roles, you brought an originality and a weight to them <laughs> that wouldn't have existed otherwise. Jared, you really get me like no one has ever gotten me. <laughs> hey, hey, Mark, I'm just a fan. <laughs> Bro, if you were gay, I'd make out with you. <laughs> Whoa, cowboy. <laughs> and then he scripted in an awkward pause. <laughs> Jared, Jared, are you there? Uh, uh, well, I, I better run. Are you sure? Yeah, I, I got some things to do. Make sure you tell Jodie to thank me, because if I hadn't told her to go out and rent you can count on me, she wouldn't even know who you are. Good grief. We wouldn't even be having this fantastic conversation. <laughs> I better should thought, buddy. Thank you, Jared. No. I love you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Mark Ruffalo. Oh, uh, well, out of all Mark's fans, send him away.